Okay, and uh, I see something noticed very unusual. These are also the cables the car came with. Uh, on one side, that's what it looks like. It almost looks like as if, uh, you know, the animals that eat trees would get a hold of it. Just that this time, these cables were not mine. And this is the first time I'm doing the review on this stuff. Uh, let's check this one out. Okay. For the rest, I will refer to the better video recording so that you can see what this looks like these cables were inside of the car I did not get a hold of them uh, they were inside of the car I also did not inspect them when I received them they were free basically they came free with a car and so um, they were playing with this stuff already way before but i just uh, want you to get an idea basically just a quick video on the go today is january the 3rd 2022 uh the cables you are about to see were destroyed by the neighbor uh whose name is andre ul andre ul uh on opportunity when a couple was here in 2017 they visited this house and on opportunity uh, the car was inspected also by this individual everything they inspected they he destroyed the cables and you're gonna see how he destroyed the cables he destroyed the cables which is red claiming me that it is the communist uh, as a matter of fact, you know what I'm thinking about? Because in 2017, I was quite pro-communist. That probably was in 2015, that stuff even happened. So that's seven years ago, when they paid visitation to this house, these cables were destroyed, but 100% Andre Ul, who told me an opportunity, uh, always claimed that he is anti-communist and is destroying my stuff for the sake of helping me out that all my wardrobe belongings need to be destroyed so that I can claim injustice so that I can repeat this stuff over and over and over again but at that opportunity uh, he destroyed me cables and stuff like this no, see, the guy is not communist. He is working for, in case he would think that he's a communist because he destroyed the cable, a red cable. He didn't help me out with this kind of stuff. He just tried to put me inside of a mental hospital. The same thing like my father did. Uh, they were destroying my property, my belongings, so they were developing human being in me, a pathos, anger resentment and all other issues you possibly can develop in an individual that's all there was right the individual is a criminal this neighbor of mine here andre oh this is a criminal with a long extensive police record he's a nobody first to begin with but is employed was employed employed against me since 1995 by milan kuchan by borut pahar <clears throat> the two individuals who did present themselves to the Chinese delegation as a communists protested here the coming chocolate factories business stuff like this um, and then once these factories came anyways they became main clients with their grandchildren uh, children of Miran Kuchan are involved in now in a latest affair into attempted theft of the public property, the nationalized public property uh, concerning nuclear facility not too far from here. Uh, it's just people that are hardcore criminals, as criminal as you get. Criminal is like the closest you can come 
when it concerns Milan Kucha and his children, when it concerns Borat Pahar. Hiding behind the Red Star, hiding behind the issue of the communism, so they can have some kind of leverage within the society, uh, so they can lean onto something and say, I am something. Uh, yeah, uh, I don't have a problem with the communism. I just have a problem, like you should have, with absolutely everything that presents itself to be something, and it's exactly what is not. Nobody makes more damage, nobody causes more damage than an individual that presents himself to be something and is exactly something that is not. Milan Kuchanov was a criminal. His image, reflection in a mirror, who might have even begun, but I'm not sure about this, because he was, to begin with, Barack Obama was no good, or in 95. This is another completely corrupt with Eric Holder, two criminals. These are regular criminals you meet on a street corner that got their PhDs, let's say, I don't know, uh, degrees, let's say, accumulated wealth literally through claiming affiliation with a communist party, with a socialist and this and that, and doing exactly something else behind it. Uh, basically selling a communist and selling a human dignity for cheap, for less, for nothing. So in this video, what I'm going to do, I'm going to present you with whatever Mr. Andre Uhl have done to me uh, in 2015, 2017, before I even bought a car. Unfortunately, and I also would not even bring the tires which the lady gave me uh, inside of the room, the summer tires, and the wheels already mounted. She gave me four tires or so summer tires I wouldn't bring them in here because everything inside of this room is destroyed is vandalized this is just how it is and so I wouldn't bring them in here uh, if you leave this anywhere outside there is where it definitely is destroyed this is how it goes <clears throat> Yesterday I video recorded the tires and also these cables because what I'm what I'm creating is a whole dossier about whatever I have uh, managed to gather all together from whatever w uh, uh, lady transferred to me, the seller of the car, Citroen, Clara. Uh, whatever she transferred to me, uh, I documented absolutely everything along. So. Uh, that's how that goes um, he stated to me red cables not the black one he said red cables not the black one red one um, communist communist yeah it was probably even in 2017 because he told me later on because they realized that uh, I don't have a problem actually with the communism. They realized that I have a flag here, a communist flag also. Is it communist? It's Chinese. Um, it's it, it looks like a communist anyways. Um, they realized so the guy said, and uh, uh, you're gonna, uh, so that you can say also this. He did like campaign against the communism, blah, 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 whatever. The, 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 the fucking guys and nobody. Hey, he's a, he's a fucking mechanic with uh, extensive crime record since he was a kid. 
he caused the problems to police. Um, no, he had whereabouts with police. He did employed police. He was a he was a he 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 gave a lot of job to police. He didn't have problems with the police. You know, in his head, he had problems with the police. But otherwise, he was a good employer for the police. He gave problems to the people. Um, so that you can, but uh, um, it was really meant in a, such a sense so that I would say, uh, so I would point a red cable, red cable, uh, so it would come out in a sense like, uh, Uh, the opposite party would see me like it was that that he caused damage to something that uh, read like hatred against the communism. No, this is actually really a matter of a police. This is a matter of the police. This is just something that this guy should be already long, long time behind the bars. I would say probably even lobotomized because you never can come to the people like this. This guy has a extensive record his record dates back to like 40 years back in time ever since and so what the fuck you do with the people that go and you just can't calm them down man they are always up to something new uh, then you have to come up with something like this so you calm them down i don't know what to say because they're ruining other people's lives with a crime this is not nuisance anymore so there you have it. Uh, let me present you what he did exactly with the cable, I think, in 2017. Knowing I will buy this car in the future. So this car, I anticipate now that the state played with the cars all along till this one will become an option. But I don't know. I don't know. I could have bought a car, another car. It could have happened. They played, and I got exactly, exactly, exactly the car. Believe it or not, I got exactly the car that... It's a match in heaven. I would say God would only bargain for, as far as myself. I'm extremely satisfied with the purchase. Uh, the thing is that I didn't drive much car. I was twice in the city, that's all I was with this car. But still, uh, what a memories this car brought to me. With this car I was taken to Serbia, all over the Serbia with a couple. And they had me in Italy too. Um, it brings tremendous, tremendous memory. The lady was involved in MK Ultra since 1996, at least, maybe even 95. It was. She has a brother, and she was the one who moved out uh, a rent apartment in Maribor. Uh, and then was a lot of disco life very attractive lady uh, then it was a disco life and she married this man from Ptui and she married to him they got married kids and so on oh. definitely very much appreciated again today is January the 3rd 2022 but what you're about to see was I have done this yesterday at night this man obviously okay evidently Andre Ull evidently obviously caused damage also to other people not only to myself as far as myself he would use they would use these drugs that completely retard you they retard your thinking and then he would go and he would present his sadistic issue one after another that would equal more than thousand probably things he anticipated he's gonna trigger uh he's gonna pull me in some kind of 
really deep mental issues and get me killed, basically. Obviously, he did cause damage also to other people. Lady came here for a visit. She left home with destroyed stuff. Nobody even guaranteed her I would purchase this car in the future. She had absolutely no guarantee whatsoever. She had to put her tail between the legs and go home humbly, basically. Nobody paid her anything for anything, absolutely not. This is the way it's done. So it was other people that suffered in the process and this is exactly the proof I have now they did because this was done in either 2015 or 2017. More likely in 2017 than 2015. What exactly that looks like. Yeah. Okay, they're free still. These cables are free, so there is not much uh, to complain about. Uh, it looks like as if somebody would have a taste for the red. Because this black here, uh, they're in one piece, I see. Both of them. They're, they're intact, but somebody somebody was bothered with the red. Uh, you can see that, but God forbid that one right there. And that's in a really poor shape. So, for me to say... I just got to do the review and then I'm going to put this back in the car. Seldomly these are used. Um, just so that you see the length of these cables, that's the main thing here. It goes somewhere up to my waist. Okay, something like this with what you see right there. I estimate this cable is about two meters long, approximately. So, otherwise, brand new, never used cables. Uh, but this car was here. This car came here for a visit. Oh, so I feel sorry for her. For the lady owner. Damn I'm gonna put them back inside of the car and that's about it. As far as other documents uh, concerning car documentation, but basically everything is in here, absolutely everything is in here, including the maintenance records. Uh, Absolutely everything is in here, you know, absolutely everything. All the stuff, everything, the technical certification, everything, when the car was purchased, everything, absolutely everything. Um, check this out, maintenance records Part 2014 and after 2014, all the receipts, everything, that, whatever she gave me, everything is, everything was scanned and listed inside of my laptop. Nah, I cannot show because there are numbers and stuff like this, but everything I have accounted for except for this cable, and so this is really, really shocking to me. Uh, and at the same time, I am totally grateful to the lady seller, to my old friend, about what she managed to preserve. Yeah, that's a karma, Mr. Wool. Uh, it did go your way back then, and it just happened so that she handed me also this very cable. The lady seller was and is a police officer veteran. That's what she did all her life. A police job.